Hi everyone, I'm Simone, CPO at Forte, and today I'm going to show you how you can redeem your Forte for Pro Tools software and how, for the first time, you can have total automation control over both mix prep and mix bound stages of your workflow, saving an incredible amount of time. If you are a Pro Tools subscriber, you can redeem your Forte for Pro Tools both on your Avid link or Avid account. Forte for Pro Tools gives you access to both our models, Forte import and Forte export. In the next section of the video, I'm gonna show you how Forte works. Let's get started. These are the audio files that we want to drag and drop on Forte. I'm doing it. You see, everything is already analyzed, so we know what everything is. I want to call this track STH because I prefer it called like this, and it's gonna do that for me. Uh, in the meanwhile, I was also doing stereo to mono, uh, and then I can also listen the tracks to be sure that those are the things that I want. This is a bass, so that's it. Once we have done all of this, we can go directly to the routing option. As you can see, since I have uh, my template um, that I can organize in customize uh, section of the product, which is here, uh, you will see that all the routing are divided by categories. Um, for example, the strings, which are here, I want to change them so that you can see how is it to do it. It's super easy. So I move them to all music. Once it's all done, be careful, you need also to have move tracks uh, enabled so that we're gonna move the tracks in the routing folder and we click on import. As you can see from my hands, I'm not doing anything. Fourteen is doing all the job for me. We are coloring tracks, we are importing tracks in the proper order. Now we're gonna route them too. And what you're gonna see is that in terms of second, you have everything routed, ordered, colored, strip silenced and moved in the proper folder. So now it's finalizing uh, the routing the way we settled before in Forte. And soon you will see that the strip silence is gonna pop up and do the tracks. Here is doing it. Strip silence, super fast. And that's it. That's how quick and easy it was to prepare a session in Forte. And that was the import. Let's go now to the export module of our product to bounce all the prints the way you prefer. So as you can see, it's so easy to move between the two modules. We now are in the export part of it. I have two different ways of doing it. The first one is create custom print, select two drums, for example, track the kick and the snare, call it drums here. Okay, I want one file, so it means that they are grouped together. I create the print. As you can see here, I already see the name of it, the number of tracks that are within it, what is the output format, and this icon is letting me know that those tracks will be grouped. I'm going to create custom pre-2, all the bases. Let's say that I want to have them individual tracks. What I need to do is just rename it, bus int, so I will remember it later. Individual files, stereo again. As you can see, this time we have three output files because it will be sequentially exported. And you also see this from the icon. Two other ways I can do it is simply going to Pro Tools. Let's do the percussion. I'm going to select the percussion with shift click. Then I do command option C and there's a notification letting me know that I already created a print. And then I have another one. If I do select the tracks that I want, I do command option V, I'm gonna do the individual uh, sequential tracks. Let's go to Forte again. You will see that the first one called print free, I'm gonna rename it perk. Three tracks again is the correct amount of tracks that I have selected. One file, which is all grouped. And the last one, which is piano, is gonna be piano individual which is uh, free tracks, free tracks because they will be sequentially exported. Once I'm done with this, the easiest thing that I can do is go to continue. Let's put a name on it, test. I want to select the miss source, in my case it's output, uh, WAV file, uh, bit def and sample rate, they are selected. I'm gonna select um, a destination if I want. If I'm not doing it, uh, they're gonna be in the bounce file of the session. If I click print, everything is starting. As you can see, the first track is uh, is happening, it's bouncing it really fi really fast, and it's uh, how it works. As you can see, working with Forte elevates your creativity by freeing up valuable time, improving consistency and quality of your work.